I brand tech here where tech is made simple. So it's Patch Tuesday again. This month's May 2021's Patch Tuesday cumulative update and a couple of other updates have started rolling out yesterday on the 11th of May 2021. I would have received mine late year, only late yesterday, so I am installing mine this morning on the 12th. Now, the latest cumulative update comes obviously with the Patch Tuesday and it is KB5003173 and it looks like at this stage it is just a couple of security updates. There's no new features or anything like that, but I will make a video later on in the day just to get back and, you know, basically do an update of what some of the changes are and what is actually some of the highlights in KB5003173. Now, as always, if you'd like to see if you have the update, just head over to your settings, then update and security. And here you can see cumulative update for Windows 10 version 20H2, that's also 2004, KB5003173. Now, as you can see, this is a mandatory compulsory update, so it will be downloaded and installed um, automatically on your machine. And if you are, say, in a workflow or obviously just don't want to be disturbed at the moment by having to do an update and restart your computer, what you can do is you can just go to um, pause for seven days and that will just give you a bit of breathing space or if you want to pause it for a longer period of time you just go to advanced options pause updates and select a date further on down the line now just a side note here if you have been experiencing some problems with updates in the past and obviously once you've installed the update you've had some problems what i suggest you do before you actually um these updates are installed is create a restore point so if there is a problem you can always go back and um, you know restore your system to a earlier timestamp that before you install the updates and that's just a safety net I have made a video on this before but that's just a safety net just create a restore point and then hopefully if there's anything wrong with this update which we hope there isn't because obviously we've had a little bit of a bad run with Windows updates at the moment then you can always restore your computer back to a earlier timestamp and then obviously if you don't want to be disturbed just um, pause for seven days or a little bit longer and then obviously I said I will get back to you later today um, just to you know um, focus on some of the highlights that are carried in KB5003173 and so that is rolling out at the moment for all Windows 10 versions 2004 and 20H2 as I say it is a compulsory mandatory update so it will be installed automatically on your machine. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.